Hello students, so let's try to solve one very beautiful problem from CSIR NET December exam and this is and this is this exam was held in March 2nd and the question ID is 705124. So it is from the mechanics and it is a wonderful question and you can see there is a it is given that there is a frictionless track is given so this is track which equation is given and that is parabola. A particle is constrained to slide on this particular track under the action of gravity. So they are just asking what will be tangential acceleration at the any position xz. So we have to give this answer in form of x and parameter z0. So how we can approach it? So if we can see this particular problem, this is your basically z direction, this is your x and at any point this is your g and we can find the tangent so we can find the tangent so we have to find the tangential direction so if you are putting the tangent then this will be your tangent so from the calculus we know that this angle is theta and this tan theta we all know is nothing but dz upon dx and from there we can easily differentiate it that will be minus 2x upon 4z0 and that value is equal to minus x upon 2z0. And what will if this angle is theta then this angle is 100% 90 minus theta. So the component of acceleration g in a, this direction is basically g sin theta. So basically we have to calculate the value of theta and from if we know the tan theta we can easily find sin theta. So what will be a theta or a tangential? So that value is equal to we have g sin theta and we have g sin theta is nothing but x upon root under x square plus 2z0 whole square and this value is equal to gx root under x square plus 4 z naught square. So your answer is 2. So option 2 is correct. So now students you can solve this question very easily. Now again I am saying that whenever you are solving the problem the previous year of the any examination at least IT jam, gate, net, just NTFR is very important. So now you can see the next in the next slide just go to our study material page number 129 that is PYQ of IT jam and there was a question and this is a question in IT jam 2027 look at this question a projectile is fired from the origin O at the angle 45 degree from the horizontal at the highest point P its trajectory the radial and at the highest point P of the trajectory you have to find the radial and transverse component of acceleration and you have to calculate this. The exactly same question is there also. In this question you have to find what will be the rate. So this is your direction of G. This will be your radial direction. This will be your tangential direction. So this is your AR. This is your A theta. The whole thing is that once you will calculate the value of theta you can easily get thing. So exactly same question you can have in this exam. Only difference is that here you have to find the theta with the equation of projectile and in this particular question, in this particular question you have to find the theta with use of calculus. That is the only difference. But the essence of question is exactly same. So student solving only PYQ without getting intuition, without getting logic is worthless. And now you can see we have exactly first question of our PYQ booklet, uh, book, PYQ of booklet and that is in the examination. So student in this time we will always give you what is the source of question and I am 100% sure once I have seen this particular uh, question at least 60% question is coming from our either study material or class notes or test or tutorial anywhere. So at least 60% question is there.